Okay, so this is the graph. So you haven't mentioned X and Y. So can you mention it? Okay. And uh, just uh, the Schrodinger equation you show. Okay, so half k x square for uh, the uh, what is the k here and what is x here? Uh, Ma'am, k is the it is the potential energy and k is the constant and x is the displacement. Okay, so can you tell me what kind of potential in real atomic uh, problem? Uh, what kind of potential can be approximated as a harmonic oscillator potential? Harmonic potential. Yes, harmonic potential in which kind of cases we can in atomic or molecules. At what situation we can find out this kind of potential? So, um, and whenever means we are doing the vibrations. Yes. Vibrations of atomic level, so that time. Yes, the harmonic oscillation. OK, that's good. So have you uh, seen that uh, if you, you I mean, can you draw the first excited state? What is the ground state energy here? First tell me. Zero point energy. OK, it's a half OK, so if you tell in terms of energy eigenvalue, you will get EN equals to N plus half H cross omega, right? Yes. Yes, so what this ground state potential energy signify here? I mean, why isn't it zero? Um, and, uh, it means it's a, a ground particle, even it hasn't, it always had, it has some minimum energy. And uh, like if we, we can explain it with the uncertainty principle. So mm -hmm. if uh, ground state energy is not zero, that means there is a, some uncertainty in position and momentum. If we consider it to zero, then uh, it, it, it violates the uncertainty principle. Then we exactly find the position and momentum simultaneously. Okay. So, can you tell me uh, in the ground state? I mean, the, you know about ladder operator, right? Yes, ma'am. So, uh, what is its role? I mean, what does it do? Sorry, ma'am. I didn't. Okay, okay, no problem. So, any question I want to ask Lakshman, sir? Uh, I want to ask a graph from mathematics. Uh, hello, uh, Monique, can you listen? Yes. Okay. Yes. okay. Uh, can you draw the graph for uh, modulus x, sin of x? Modulus sin of x. x. No, modulus of x multiply sin of x. Yes. Sin of x. Yes. Can you draw this? Okay, uh, can you differentiate what is the meaning it's of like odd function? Yeah, that's correct. Same so, no. Uh, yeah. In the left hand side, whether it is increasing or decreasing? Say increasing. Is it an odd function or, or an even function? It's an odd function. Do you know the meaning of odd function and even function? 
Yes, sir. So if uh, like uh, if any function showing some symmetry, then it will say symmetry function. And all about the axis, about the region. So about, about the, the region. About the origin. About the what? Uh, okay, about can the y-axis. Uh, two examples, uh, one for the odd function and another for the even function. And can uh, can you draw both both of those? Those, like you give the example of even function and draw that function also. So, um, so cos is a, a even function, cos x. Okay. Yes, sir. and the sine x is the graph it's of the odd function. Oh, yes. And what? Uh, okay. And the even odd function we are saying sine of x. Can you draw the sine of x? Sin. Yes. 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 Can you now tell me whatever what symmetry uh, were you talking about? Sir, if uh, we check symmetry along uh, along the y-axis, so it's showing yes. that uh, like uh, it's just opposite uh, uh, right. Uh, sorry, negative. Uh, so, so no is sine of x the symmetry or the y-axis? Mm -hmm. No, sir. And, oh, okay, this is not symmetry. Yes, sir. Okay, is there any symmetry in the sine of x? No, sir. No symmetry. I'm not asking about the y-axis only. Any other symmetry is possible. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. that is not the case. Uh, these functions are actually symmetric about uh, if you draw a line y equals to negative of x. Can you draw? So, sir. y equals to minus x. So, can you please speak? Yes. I'm saying y equals to minus x, yes. How will this yes. line look like? <laughs> On the same graph, you can draw. On the sign of x graph only. Yes. So, if a function is symmetric about this axis, or if it is symmetric mm -hmm. in the opposite quadrants, like in the first quadrant or the third quadrant, quadrant and similarly mm -hmm. in the second quadrant and the fourth quadrant, then that is the odd function. So, this is actually symmetric about the opposite quadrants. But the function oh, that you are drawing, a cosine of x, it is symmetric about y axis. That's why we are saying that it is an even function. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. From opposite uh, axis. Uh, I want to ask this one. Okay, sir. Sathi, ma'am, do you want to ask something? No, no. Okay, Manpreet, you can leave and we shall announce the uh, results after discussion with each other. Okay? Yes, okay. Okay.